Okay, so you might have noticed in the last video I paused it rather, I stopped it rather quickly, and that's because I lost steering. Turns out, I don't know if we can see this, but I might try zooming in maybe. There's a, a grub screw or a set screw. Okay, too far. Hang on. Let's see if I can get in there closer to it. Anyway, on the steering shaft. Right in there the right way. There you go. Now you can just barely make it out. Right there. Um, there's a set screw. So I'm going to have to tighten that down. Uh, because right now I turned the steering wheel and it doesn't turn the gear down here. And uh, it was fun getting it back from the street uh, <laughs> to, <laughs> to here to get it uh, to work. Um, I think I'm going to remove that screw and put in a grub screw with a head on it so I can tight, really tighten it down. Um, but that won't be today. I don't have that today, so I'll play with that. Uh, the only other thing I'm going to do today is replace the, uh, put a inner tube in this tire because it keeps going flat. And then uh, quick mail call at the end, just a couple of letters, and then uh, we'll wrap it up. Try to make it shorter than last week, or two weeks ago now, I guess. So, anyway. Okay, took like two seconds. It was just barely loose. I mean, it's barely, but it's working now. So, time to take the tire off, put an inner tube in it. Yikes, we'll see how that works. Turns out it didn't need a uh, inner tube after all. It's just a hole that somebody plugged up with that thing. And it was leaking, and I couldn't see it before, but I don't know, for some reason I was able to see it this time. So, put a new plug in it. Seems to be holding air. So, I saved myself a little bit of headache there. Okay. I uh, guess we'll start with a uh, uh, postcard from uh, Steve. Mr. Willis's uh, 5719 on YouTube, Steve's Garage. I don't know if you can see that. There we go, if I stand back. Nice sticker, thank you, bud. Uh, I know you didn't forget. I figured you were just busy. You haven't seen a video in a while, so that made me think you were just real busy. So that'll be going up in the cabinet. And I got another one from... My buddy Terry in Texas, Texas Viking, one of the best welders, if you ask me. I, I don't, you know, I can't say that that guy. I haven't seen anything he can't weld and do like textbook welds. He also has great advice on his channel and stuff, and does a little home life in there and stereos and whatnot. So if you don't, if you haven't checked out Terry, check him out. Uh, he'll be going up. His, that's his new sticker. Right? He'll be going up in there. He also sent me a Texas flag. 
and I got a nice little spot for that. So get these on the board and so if I don't drop them and then uh, get right back to you. Okay, I did it again. I called it a board up on the cabinet. Cabinet. Um, Texas Viking, nice North uh, to Carolina man, and Pennsylvania cooking, and Helga's Pennsylvania cooking, and then Steve's scratch right there. And as for the Texas flag, one second. And it's right below the American flag, right where it says proud to be an American, on the door leading in and out. Want people to know I'm proud of Texas too. Proud of all the states, but know somebody in Texas finally. <laughs> okay, so that's it. Thanks guys and Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Everybody be safe and enjoy time with your family and friends no matter what you celebrate. Later.